Hey guys, this is Nathan, and welcome back to SevTech. So, got a little bit of stuff to show you. Some things that I have figured out between episodes. So one of them is that I figured out we can put a lot more items in these chests. So we can put 12 stacks of items in here. I didn't realize that I wasn't hitting the whole thing. So we can put a lot more items in there. I went ahead and made another one. And I'm putting some of the other items in there. Another thing is, is I figured out how to make torches. So we make these unlit fiber torches. We look at the recipe on these guys. And it is a piece of twine and a stick. Now, in order to light these, I had to make some fire sticks, light the ground on fire, and then right click on the fire. Now, once you have a burning torch, you can light additional torches. So I have another torch here. I'm going to go ahead and set that here above the crafting stump. And I think what I'm going to do now is head downward, dig down... What was that? Some, did I just hear something blow up? I don't, I, I don't know. But anyway, I am going to dig down here and hopefully uh, find a little bit more stone or something because, yeah, we need materials. We need all kinds of stuff. So I'm going to get a little bit of digging done and see if I can decide what I want to be working on today. So I've got a few recipes set up here. So we needed to make our grate for our fire pit. And so that, like I said, is three pieces of stone and then three of our rocks. And we're going to hit that with our crafting rock. And there we go. There's that thing. So hot grill. Woo that ought to be something that we can put like here, I think. So yeah, I don't know for sure how that works, but anyway look at it we'll figure it out eventually so next up we have let's take a look at our recipes here we have the free range hawks craft a tomahawk to use a ranged weapon note the recipe needs one flaked flint point so uh the flaked flint points we get those by taking a flaked flint and hitting them against the rock so we have a flaked flint a point a stick and a twine. We'll go ahead and smack this guy for a little bit. There we go. There is our tomahawk. Free range hawks. All right. So that did not open anything up. I was kind of expecting that it would. Oh well. But that's besides the point. So uh, we have a few other things here that we could kind of look at. But I think now we're going to, at least for a brief amount of time, take our own path. So. I saw this recipe and I have a feeling this is a way to pick up dirt. So this is a trowel. This is a piece of dirt, a piece of flint, and a stick. And so we're going to grab this. And so I'm pretty sure that we can pick up grass blocks with that. And then we are going to make ourselves a stone sword and a stone shovel. And we're going to need both of those just to basically do our normal stuff. And then also, one thing that I did not realize what it meant, there is a little shelf in the front of these uh, crafting stumps, and you can put your crafting rock in there. So that is really nifty. I like that. So let's see, we got any mobs around here? Does not look like it. So that's good. So I want to take my little garden trowel that I got. And okay, so we can make a path block with that. Can we pick up... No, we can't pick up... I thought that we could pick up uh, grass blocks with that. But I guess not. But it did give us a worm. So, this is not the type of worm that you get from uh, whatever... Uh, actually, additions. But... Uh, yeah, so we can get worms. Looks like we can also get uh, the plant fiber from grass blocks. Interesting. So, uh, yeah, that didn't work the way that I wanted it to. But uh, we also have a rock over here that I can't dig. 
Not sure what this is. I think it might be like blue stone or something. I saw some that looked like it in... Uh, well, I actually don't know if this is an EI or JEI. But, uh, yeah. Unfortunately, we weren't able to do everything that I thought we were going to be able to. But, so... I think we need desperately to find that village because we are going to need food. So, yeah. I think I'm going to have to go and do some exploring. So, hopefully I can find a village. And... When we get there, maybe we can do a little trading and get some uh, farming up. Well, this is definitely not the way that I wanted to spend the night. Up on a nerd pole. I've never had to be on a nerd pole. What the heck? This sucks. Oh, there's a lot of stuff burning down there. Stop burning! What in the heck is that? Oh my god, what is that? That thing is ugly! And it killed a sheep. And it's leaving little ones of itself behind. What in the... It's seeking out sheep and trying to kill them. Hmm. I don't know what the heck those are. What the heck? That thing was like pink and purple. And then it blows up? Just because? Well, that's no good if we're going to have our terrain destroyed by things like that. What the heck was that even? I don't know if I like that idea. Now, well, there's still a few mobs around here. But we're going to have to try to get somewhere. I am really starting to wonder if there's actually any villages around here. But I'm going to keep looking for a while. And, uh, hopefully, I won't get killed. Stupid zombie. Yeah, you're gonna burn. Oh well. See you guys in a bit. I'm not sure about that. What is this? It's a skeleton. It's one of the fossils that we can get, but it's above ground be a nice early shelter now one thing that I have noticed we have 1.13 mechanics in here so one of the mobs has that is that a village that's a village that's a village all right well we're gonna head to this village over here awesome 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 by the way been uh, collecting tons and tons of stuff here and uh, found out we can pick up these wild berry bushes that I've been finding and so we'll have all the fruit we could possibly want but we have a village finally found a village so I will see if we've got any decent uh, villagers here and uh, yeah hopefully we can figure out how to do some trading or get a map or something trading farming Ah, the sound of annoyance. So, we need bone meal to turn into farmland, and that's actually what we're supposed to do. So I guess I'll need to go back up and get that uh, bone fossil thingamajigger. Yeah, we got torches here. Let's see if there's anything good around this village. There's a lot of farmers, that's good. But also it looks like there's no crops. These pretty much all look like farmers. Here we got a Fletcher. We have some garbage. Man, these, this village is like disaster area. Yeah, there's like nothing here. All of the structure uh, setups have been changed. 
Not a traditional village, that's for sure. Whoa. What the hell was that sound? Um, you guys better get somewhere safe. Well, I'm gonna head back and get that, uh, those bone blocks. Kill this piranha. Multiples! There we go. Stupid piranhas. But see, you can see the items are floating on the water. So yeah, we are definitely 1.13 mechanics. But uh, I need to get those bone blocks and then I'll be back. Well, I wasn't able to continue on with doing the stuff for the village right now. But I am able to continue on with our other stuff. So what we need to do is light a fire underneath this uh, grill. Realized that. And then we can turn our cobblestone into smooth stone. So I'm going to be working on this for a little bit until I can get the six cobblestone. And then we can work on whatever that quest was that needed the six smooth stone. So I remember what was going on here now. I was trying to get the bone blocks for bone meal. Unfortunately, these bone blocks have to be ground up in a grindstone and that's what we needed the smooth stone for so now we can finally make this thing we'll go ahead and get this so we got the advancement grind it so yeah I have a feeling this is gonna be kind of a slow thing so I can imagine what we do is right click these on here Ooh. okay how many times I think it was it said, do I have to do the whole pile? Oh God, no. Oh, that is a long and drawn out thing. I, how do I get my bone meal out of there? There we go. So, yep, I got tons of bones to grind up. I can get the bone meal out of here and I suppose if I wanted to, I could harvest tons of these bone blocks. But right now, this is kind of my shelter, so I don't really want to destroy it. Put all of the dirt that I had down to block the entrances, but... Yeah, we're going to get a bunch of bone meal here. Let's get one more set. There we go. Do we have to have an empty hand to do that? Yeah, whatever. So let's go ahead and head back to the village, trade with those farmers, and see what we can do. So this guy's got a better price than the last one anyway. So eight bone meal for a piece of farmland. Alright, teach a man to farm. So we're only going to do that once. Looks like the rest of this we can turn flowers into other flowers. Apple seeds? Hmm. I don't know if that's necessary, but... Yeah, we're going to go ahead and grab an apple seed. Why not? Be Johnny Apple Seed. Cotton seeds. I know that we can get those back at our base. Baked carrots. I did not know that we could bake carrots, but that'll give us grape seeds, which we already have. Pick those up somewhere. Tomato seeds for bread? Okay, we got a lot of different kinds of seeds. And we still have the Fletcher. So what did we get unlocked here? Nothing. Eh, okay, whatever. But, let's take a look at our advancements here. So that gave us nothing! Alright, so now we need to find that librarian. Find out what he needs. He wants feathers and ink sacks to get the empty antique atlas. Oh... Well... I guess. Here, let's grab another piece of uh, farmland as long as we're at it. Why are your farms all run down and covered in weeds? Oh well. Well, I'll head back up to our little hole in the ground over there. 
get a little bit of uh, farm planted and going and uh, try to get a little bit more of the bone meal so that we can get more farm blocks try to get those feathers and in ink so that we can get a map and we'll see what map we've actually got here there is something outside of my base well base my hole that is growling I am really wondering what this is now I did see bear claws in the uh, whatever uh, over here we have bear claws over here so this might be a bear I am not sure so I don't know if I even want to risk going outside where are you so I was going around trying to get stuff oh well we got oh cool we have ninja zombies Ninja Zombies! <laughs> hey, that wasn't very nice. Karate Zombie, okay. So, did they drop something special? Doesn't look like it, but he did hurt. So where is this thing? Ah, my mouse is going too fast. There, that's better. Oh, it's a wolf. A dire wolf. Can we give him a bone? You want a bone? For some reason, I have a feeling that he is not going to like us. Well, here. If we can't give him a bone, then we're going to do the next best thing and throw rocks at him. Go away. Go on. Get... Go on. You is a bad doggy. Yes, bad doggy. Bad. 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 Hee <laughs> hee. No more bad doggy. Oh, but I hear a spider. And I just threw a bunch of stuff outside. So here, let's go ahead and block that back up. Yeah, middle of the night. I have a lot of new stuff. I was out killing cows and sheep. Got a lot of meat. Got a lot of uh, hides or pelts. So we're going to have to figure out what we do with those. I know making leather is going to be something very similar to what it is in Technode Firmacraft. So spiders I don't like. I have already killed one. They look surprisingly disgusting where are you there he is yeah they look very disgusting yeah let me in and I don't know what you are doing but you're dead now so I don't have to worry about you okay so let's get the stuff that we accidentally threw outside and there's a wolf pelt so what can we let's go ahead and just place some dirt down grab that wolf pelt so there's another pelt uh, let's go ahead and get inside we need to block the entrance quickly 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 there we go all right so yeah wolves nice so yep gonna cook my food because i need that try to clean up my inventory and we'll look at what we need to do next in the advancements well, apparently piranhas will jump out of the water at you. That's not exactly a good thing. But I'm still trying to get uh, my inventory all sorted out. This is a very time-consuming process because we have to uh, get tons and tons of wood. And I'm not just going to cut down trees because we also need tons and tons of sticks. I've been trying to cook... Uh, my foods and everything so that I've got that all taken care of so I've been using sticks for that and yeah it's just kind of a like I say a time-consuming process and now I'm out of flint for these work blades so I've got to get this flint but yeah 
I'm actually looking at the area here, and I think this is a really good place for us to set up shop, because, well, we are really close to actually two villages. So there's also a village, well, there's the one over here that we found, and there's another one off in that direction that is in a dark uh, roofed forest, whatever. That thing. But, so uh, yeah, I still have, apparently, a lot of stuff to take care of, and wow, this tree is deep into the ground. What on earth? So, oh, I did not want to do that. So, let's go ahead and place these back here. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to get back out of here, get back into the safety of our little hole over here. Our uh, skeleton house. Um, that was not there just a second ago. What? Um, uh, mm -hmm. I don't know if I like that. The terrain changes? Well, we'll have to keep an eye on that because if uh, water washes away dirt and makes caves, that's actually kind of a neat effect. We'll have to see if that actually works. So, yeah, more chests so that I can get more inventory cleaned up, and then I'll be back. Uh, I think we have a clown. What the heck? Are you freaking kidding? That made me jump like none other. Oh, he has the corn of... the horn of... Uh, cacophony or something like that. Well, he didn't drop it. What a little bit! So I think that's like a... Isn't that like a... a tanny item or something? I don't remember. But yeah, I found out I can cook my carrots, but I have to do that on my grill. So, uh, yeah, just finishing up cooking my meat here. This is the last piece of meat to cook. I could cook some potatoes, but I think I'm going to... Uh, hold those and use them for uh, planting rather than cooking at the moment because, uh, yep, yeah, potatoes, I think that's what we are going to want to be eating for our vegetable. So uh, we are getting fairly low on the grain. Vegetables not doing great, but everything else is doing real good. So, uh, yeah, rain, that's annoying, but uh, gonna keep going with what we're going with. Well, we have a nature golem here. Now, I know the iron, or was it iron golems? The, not iron golems, the golems for, uh, not roots. Uh, the other one, uh, embers, required you to kill them with a pickaxe, so, yeah. We're gonna see here. He can't hit me because he's dumb. Really? That's all you give? Gunpowder? You suck. But, uh, yeah. What I got going on here, since this is going to be a more permanent location for us now, decided I would uh, try to clean up the entrance here a little bit. And, yeah, vast improvement over what we had. And this dang spider. Would you just let me kill you? These spiders, yeah, they are scary beyond our reason. And how are you taking so long to kill? Oh, because my sword is dead. My sword is broken. Okay, well, that would explain it. I was doing half a heart with, with each hit. All right. But, uh, yeah, starting to get a little bit of a... Uh, safer area here. It's a little bit cleaner, more organized, starting to make it actually look like something. So, uh, gonna keep working on this between episodes because I think this is gonna be it for this one. So I'm gonna say thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to give a thumbs up. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. If you have any thoughts about what I've been working on or something that you would like to see, be sure to leave that down in the comments. 
I will still be doing the Technode Firmacraft because, uh, yeah, I've got big plans over there. want to keep working on that. So, uh, yep, I will see you guys next time. Bye. Well, it's actually a wild dog this time. So let's see if we can tame this guy. Bones? No? Want meat? No? Ow! A dog! No? You don't want to eat, huh? No, I hate to do this, Pooch, but apparently you're gonna have to die. Ow! Broke my chest piece. What a little butt.